Hey guys, welcome back to another one of my YouTube videos. If you're new here, howdy, welcome. And if you're returning back, well, welcome on back. YouTube is a rather large platform, once you really think about it. There's so many niches and all this content out there. So many things are happening. In fact, there's a whole niche dedicated to YouTubers who are in jail, like searching that stuff up and then making videos about YouTubers who are now placed in jail. And as a fellow YouTuber, I wanted to see what my coworkers were up to. And I came across one that I've never heard about, like, ever and they stood out completely like all the way out there and it was kind of creepy because and good at the same time because when i searched their name up on youtube only two people have covered them fully youtube has creators that post breastfeeding videos that are strongly and by that i mean those videos aren't to feed their kids, give them the nutrients that they need, or for educational purposes. It's posted for a targeted audience for people who are seeking to get self-pleasure. So to zone in and to one creator specifically who is incredibly infuriating has made my whole night crappy, Lee Felton. Lee was a piano teacher, but once her husband left her and the baby, she became money hungry and started posting breastfeeding videos on her YouTube that were clearly meant to be sexual. She realized that it wasn't new moms trying to figure out how to breastfeed their babies, uh, but she did realize that it was those scumbags who were wanting to view this for their pleasure. And she leaned into it and started to make it more disgusting. Not saying that breastfeeding is disgusting, but you know, make it gross. More or less making it disgusting and creepy for those creepy old men who want to get some of that Slim Jim pleasure, if you know what I mean. Lee was making breastfeeding videos while rubbing her baby down in baby oil and her whole entire naked self in baby oil and like smashing her chest into the baby's face. She would even go as far as naming her videos slip and slide mommy's a whore. I mean so not only was this public to view on YouTube she sold unlisted even more explicit video links to her viewers so imagine the free stuff is already bad imagine what's on those links so how did she get caught so this guy had purchased the link from lee and i'm guessing his wife caught him with the link on his phone and she saw all of lee's you know content that she puts out there and she called the police and hopefully that guy got arrested for having cp on his phone and yeah now she's in court initially she was charged with this whole list 34 counts of capital sexual battery child pornography and all of that stuff that you see down there she was only found guilty of one of those charges which put her in the hole for 10 years when she deserved a life sentence in trial she kept saying that this was a silly little playful thing and didn't believe that this was criminal she used her child to feed these disgusting men's or whatever you want to call this I just feel like we need to check everybody's browser history, everybody's PayPal, Cash App, Venmo, Zelle, whatever you use to get that kind of content from her and make sure that the people who were okay with this and let her slide by to only get 10 years instead of year life sentence, we need to make sure that these people ain't supporting her and letting her eat, breeze on through so in 10 more years, she can make another baby. And her lawyers were just as bad. They tried to argue that her content was backed by free speech. Y'all, I cannot make this stuff up. As crazy as we know that this sounds, it must have worked some kind of way, somehow, with the smooth brains that were in there, in the courtroom with her, 
that made them be okay to drop all 34 charges and leave her with one only giving her 10 years. There's so much evidence of her selling this content. There was so much free evidence that they could get into her stuff and look at all of the stuff that she has produced with her baby. Overwhelming evidence, disgusting evidence that she has produced all of this and all of those charges were dropped for what? But it is safe to say that her child was taken away from her. So hopefully they can't get back together when she gets out of jail. But like, it's just, it's crazy to me. Like she only got 10 years out of all of that. People were saying that she was rubbing her on the baby's chest. For the people who don't know, YouTube has always had that room for nudity on the platform, but it was only for educational purposes and like artistic reasons. But of course, that was getting abused. People found that loophole where they could basically put up some raunchy stuff and then claim it as being artistic. I don't know if you guys recall, but there was an older lady who dressed up in a morph suit, cut the crotch out, exposing them lips, had some man pick her up walking around in circles as she peed in a circle. I don't know if it was this video that did it, but YouTube quickly realized that that little space that they had to showcase artistic and educational purposes nudity, they went ahead and got locked down on it. Though I have heard that there is full nudity yoga videos out there surfacing somewhere where it's for educational purposes and people are going into yoga poses and they're showing how the human body reacts to those poses. Yeah, that's a thing. But anyway, back on topic, you can post nudity for educational purposes. And that's why this didn't get flagged because it was marked as, oh, I'm teaching you guys how to breastfeed your baby if you don't know how to do that. And of course, Lee Felton took advantage of that. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching another one of my YouTube videos. Uh, make sure you subscribe and never forget who loves you the most. It is I, it is me. I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you. And until the next video, I will see you until the next video. I just talked in a circle, so subscribe if you like that because I know you did. Subscribe anyways if you hated it. Bye guys. <laughs>